video shoot, and it's like a day in the life of Slaughterhouse, really, you know? We're in Austin, Texas. We pull up to like this hood, hood, hood barbecue spot. You got all these people with camera equipment running around and shit. First thing I'm thinking is, have any one of these production guys, directors, or anybody talked to anybody from this hood? Because when you go into somebody's hood and shoot a video, you don't know if you're going to make it out that motherfucker. You don't get permission from like the OGs, and, you know, the niggas who built the corners over there. It's just a gesture that shows that you respect that it's not your hood, you know what I mean? I definitely was on the hunt and I found some OGs. The, the dude who owned the barbecue spot was an OG. Sound barbecue, straight in the middle of the hood. Duke down East 12th Street, where you don't need no TV, my beef at, bro. Just come on in here. And he was like, shit, ain't nothing going down in here. I got everything in here. Hey, yeah, he Sound barbecue in Austin, Texas. The best goddamn brisket in town. I brisket so good, I had all my teeth pulled out and put our label on there. You want my teeth? You want me to take mine? And then that brisket? That shit is goddamn. Off the chain, man. Off the chain, man. Yeah, it made me horny. I swear to God. I'm ready for some more. Trade the Truth came out. Salute. Rocket came out. Salute. Hey. Whoa. Oh. 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 Hey, that one, bro. <laughs> we had a body of a fucking swine just hanging off the fucking tree. I mean, it was crazy, man. I don't know, it was this crazy woman, man, who kept saying, you know, deny no allegations. Yeah. I'm not here to deny no allegations. I'm asking. We in ATX, nigga. We represent Sam Barbecue. Yeah, so she gets to chase a keno around. We deny an allegation. The value of the police that we're pulling. We deny an allegation. See how they deal with this movie? Wait, wait, wait. This is the original movie, you know, nigga. I don't even want to look behind me. See, I'm pushing on my back. That shit was like slow motion. That shit got real. She'll be, she be taking another step. I'm like, I know she gonna stop it. Nine allegations. It's always funny to see a grown man run, you know what I'm saying? We had the photo shoot for our album cover artwork in Atlanta. We had the dope stylists there, the dope barbers there. We had a we had a good time. We rocked out. You get the sense that it's really happening. People are excited about it. Everything is is looking dope. You know what I mean? So it's an achievement, you know. And I think it's an achievement for every member of Slaughterhouse. Boy, Joel Ortiz, man. It's my nigga D right here, Dennis in the spot, man. You get cabin fever on a tour bus and being away from home for like months. So what happens is niggas try to figure out how to entertain each other. So do I just push this button on the side? Yo, yo, bust it, bust it, check it, bust it. I come through with the ill whip. <laughs> Slaughterhouse owning two. <laughs> I know you guys really want to eat something really well. You try to watch your weight, keep healthy. But uh, Foot Ruckers is uh, right up the block. We're in there too. <laughs> is this thing on? <laughs> Yo, Kino, why you got a mannequin face? <laughs> Kino is just canvas, right? Like, <laughs> Sometimes I just feel so bad for Kino, man, because he does all the business, and then niggas give him the business. <laughs> Joel Ortiz is hilarious. He could fucking stop rapping and be a comedian right now. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't know that. Theory, do you believe? I believe there's evidence. Joey be like, yeah, I'm gonna play this record. You ain't got shit to do with where I'm from. But I need to do it. I remember what you did and wanna work with me. Now my car fucks itself and fucks itself and orders. Then that nigga be doing fast lane, he got his bump going. Then he get to the part they supposed to do. <laughs> well, we got this tour assistant named Snacks. He got many names, let's just put it that way. Boston, Snackavelli, Snack Bundles, you know what I'm saying? He's very helpful, but he's an interesting character. I'm gonna make 
make them normal, you can't refuse. You're not gonna add ingredients. You're not gonna add the necessary ingredients that need to be added. You know, it might be a good omelet, it might not be a good omelet. You know, it's up to you, that's your own dilemma. This guy thinks we kill us, we're not killers, we omelet makers. <laughs> So we got Snack of Valley is a tourist system and Ryan. They kind of like battle each other for points. They try to outdo each other to the point where sometimes if you just walk by the hallway, you can hear the motherfuckers in there fussing at each other shit. You know what I'm saying? Johnny, what you gonna turn the camera on this soft ass nigga? <laughs> <laughs> don't put that in the bottom. Don't wait. Put hard don't worry shit about in the what I do put about my nigga bottom. shit, baby. Put the, shut up and put the box in. I'm, Yo, no, I'm get out of here. To touch him. I'm gonna be the last one. Get out of here. Let with me your touch him. Go get Royce's back. Smack shit at him. They end up going and buying some pellet guns and shooting at each other. <laughs> <laughs> get it, get it, hold it, stop. 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 Kino's trying to use the bathroom, bro. Hurry up. He yeah, we done, man. His corner, you know, the guys always say I tell a lot of stories. I mean, I've been through a lot of shit in my life, dog. You know, probably more than the average person. I start drinking, I might start telling stories about shit. You know, we all exchange stories, but they always say I got interesting stories and shit. It's so funny too, dog, because I got this one story about Trigger Tretch from Naughty. Salute. The other night I'm with Kino, we on stage with Tretch. And Tresh went straight into the same story that I've been telling all this time. And I don't want to say too much about that little story right there, but all I got to say is, you know, we went to High 97. There's a few niggas who didn't like us. Tretch held us down, you know what I mean? He had everything that he needed to hold us down outside, downstairs. He had to build us around with goons. And he was like, yo, go up there and say whatever the fuck you want to say. And don't worry about nothing going on out here. Cause I got you. Right, just to be sure, just to make sure everything is right. We don't even talk anymore. <laughs> and we don't even know what we are giving all about. But I was wanting to. We hurt each other. Why do we put out? Let's not wait to move Nah, I'm telling you, where's Joe Budden or else? No one's leaving here. You serious? Uh, I'm serious. serious.